going on it's your boy red eyes back up with another video god damn we're over here at the red eyes headquarters we're gonna about to be working on the on the wagon get a prep for winnie fest it's in a couple of weeks i believe on march 20th so we're gonna get be getting it ready i'm sorry it's been a while since i've done a blog so forgive me but the first thing i mean you've seen the title we're gonna do the bull bar install, but first we're gonna do a little. Uh, I'm not sure what this is called, but this is um, I guess for the hood, it's like a little cover, you know. Like, I don't know what you would call it. It goes right here on the hood. We're gonna start by installing that. This came off the brown wagon, the free wagon, whatever you want to call it, but now it's going on my wagon. So we're gonna start by installing that shit. Be the first thing. So yeah, guys, yee, let's do this. <music> Other wagon, but whatever you know, I, I didn't want to wash it. Like I said, it looks kind of fragile. And then over here, you see when I was passing the line, it kind of got kind of messed up. So, I mean, it's not in perfect shape, but it's in good shape. So, I'm just gonna leave it like that because it looks pretty neat. Oh, shit. Yee, goddamn. So, next, we're gonna start in the bull bar. As you know, sorry, though. Freaking whatever that shit passes every day, but anyway, so you know, the bull bar was cut up, and then the homie, um, young static was nice enough to help me out with it. He made his own custom brushes, everything, so it just goes back in the wagon. So we can just bring that out. And I mean, if I don't know how to install it, he's got a video on it, we'll have the link to that video in this video. That out you see how he he fixed it and everything i'm just gonna put it on my wagon right now so you guys i'm gonna get the bull bar yeah hell yeah guys so here's the bull bar as you can see it's the custom bracket that uh dana made with the little cheese and he also made these custom brackets out of the the toe hitch piece so he's also got this awesome lug nut so that when it's facing up i don't have to put the lug nut and then screw this on and make it a little bitch and then i have to tighten it so he welded those up for me thank you i really appreciate this shit bro also the bow bar uh it's missing the bottom piece i've been polishing it as you can see it's got some polish i really haven't had time to work on it much but i tried to polish it a little bit i still need to polish it all but yeah, we got the wagon on them blocks. I got the damn one floor mats and the other one. Got it. So we're gonna go in here and we're gonna replace this bracket. And this one, we're gonna take it off and we're gonna put on Super P. Oh, wait, shit, that's tiny. That's tiny. Fuck, fuck. Oh, shit. 
Come on, baby, come on. Come on. Oh, shit. What oh, there's another one. Fuck. All right, all right, we're gonna hit. Hell yes, we got bracket number one. We got bracket number two on. We're just gonna take these bolts off. Real quick. And it's loose, that way there's any fitment problems, there's some wiggle room. Let's look at this. Don't look at this plate. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Alright, we gotta take out this bolt and this bolt when you don't look at that. Can we go put the bolt bar, baby? Yay, this shit's fucking hard. I wish I had a jack stand. Maybe in the future. Anyway, so we're gonna do this and that, whatever. Let's get this done. Let's get this done, baby. Pretty sturdy. God damn. I still need to lower it so I can see it. It sucks that I couldn't run the lip. But what can we do? We got to run the bull bar for now. Maybe I'll... I was thinking I have a couple more lips in there. And I was thinking since it were hit, I might just cut it into like three sections. <laughs> it's a ghetto, but it looks sick, I think. But we'll see because there's also a metal piece so it might just be two pieces so yeah guys let's see i'm gonna lower the car i'm gonna tighten it up lower it i might put the bottom piece but i'm still trying to see if i can polish the bottom part i'm gonna put the lights on and then yee, you guys will see what it looks like god damn i'm excited for this so let's lower this bitch and check it out <laughs> So a couple of weeks I remember since I worked on the wagon. Yeah, sorry, like I was saying, got distracted a little bit by my dad. So we right now what we're doing is we're working on the wife's car. So we hit with me. And uh we're gonna do the the C V axle passenger side. I'm not gonna really record much. I'm just gonna put it on the time lapse if you guys wanna see it. I mean if you guys wanna know how to do it, there's a lot of videos enough videos to look at so that's what i did so yeah you guys just enjoy the time lap and yeah we we'll keep working on the wagon after this clip so yeah enjoy Yay! later <laughs> i'm full of oil or some shit let's see that let me show you the aftermath we got it out but so we got the axle out 
but that shit ripped on us. And then here, there's the other piece right there. Oh, fuck, my camera's all blurry and shit. It's over there, right there, right there, right there. So we got it out, but it was a bitch because that ripped. I don't know, if, I mean, that made a difference, but I kept hitting with different shit. And then I figured if I put it in neutral and turn it, and I turned it a little bit, and that shit came out once I hit it with my my Chivo. Gotta use my carpentry tools. God, then I was a bitch and I have, I was about to give up, but I never give up. So I'm a cat. But anyways, so we got the new, the new, new motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Right here's a new CV axle from Direct Import. I'm a fucking you know, saying, sponsored. Gee, no, we're not. I'll so put that shit back on and then hopefully that's one pro problem down from the court. So when you got a project car, you always run into shit. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna put you in the time lapse. Back to it. Yeah. God damn, so we're coming back from O'Reilly's. They gave us the wrong part. It was the same axle, just a little bit shorter. Maybe it was the driver's side, I don't know. But we got the new one, baby. Sheesh, where's the plug? Right. Anyway, so we're gonna be back on the timeline, putting that shit back together. Hopefully that's time or done, baby, cause shit, I'm tired as fuck, bro. Not a mechanic, but YouTube mechanic. Shit, baby. All right. <laughs> Keep cleaning the wagon and yeah, get ready for Winnie Fest. So, yeah, she's got work to do, baby. So, let's get to it. Yeah, you guys, so we're still working on the wagon right here. Right now, we got the freaking armrest that I've been saying I want to put on the wagon for like four or five videos. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take off the fabric from here on the top, this one, and I'm gonna try to replace it with this. It's from a uh, Another wagon that's the same color as my seat. If this is gray, it'll match a little bit better. So yeah, guys, let's get that shit started. Sheesh. Also shout out to the homie, David. He hooked it up with this fabric. So yeah, baby. And uh, yeah, let's get it. <laughs>
guys are. Hell yeah. I'm looking for her. Okay, I'm going to get this shit. So I'm gonna take off this seat, vacuum the bottom, and then install this new baby. Hell yeah, guys! So yeah, let's keep on working, baby. Sheesh! I hope I don't have to take off both seats. guys and just like that the wagon is ready for the car show we did have a little starting issue i think my battery is going out so i'm gonna go get one right now and hopefully that solves the problem now i'm just gonna take some jumper cables and hope i make it my wife might take the car but we'll, see. we'll figure that out see i'm see the wagon already clean letting it run so the battery can charge i clean all that shit i didn't even check until the end Always a little thing, but anyways, guys, wagon's ready. So we see you guys at the next video. So we need fast. So enjoy that, guys. If you enjoyed this video, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Don't forget to I mean, stay tuned for the next one. So we'll see you guys later. Yee! Sorry, I'm okay. You know, you know, a little bad. Kind of hard to talk. Yee! I'll see you in the next one. Peace.